What is going on, people? It is your boy, Daddy Mac, and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. We are against Ash, who's bringing a mythical Pokemon and a legendary Mewtwo. Um, I think that as long as we set up our sun and try to get a sweep going with Venusaur, we will be a-okay. Um, the biggest problem on this team, I must say, is going to be either the Gengar or the Umbreon. And I know it's kind of crazy I say that, given that he has a Magiarna on this team, which actually is a big threat also. Um, but even more than the Mewtwo, I would say, because as long as I can control Mewtwo with a um, with the sleep, I should be okay. Um, now, my question is, who do I want to go with? If he starts uh, Mewtwo, I'm, a, I'm in a little bit of a, of a bind and in trouble. Uh, I'm not looking forward to this. I'm not looking forward to this. Every time I face a legendary team, uh, well, a Pokemon, a team with an opponent, I can't talk right now. I'm so sorry. Every time I face a team that has a legendary Pokemon on it, I tend to lose. Um, I've actually noticed a trend as far as that goes, and we're just trying to avoid taking an L here. So we are against Ash, who's bringing a really cool lead card, to be honest. Mine, I must say, I'm still in love with my lead card, to be honest. It's probably the best lead card I've created in a, in a long time. But he's gonna start Pikachu. Um, who did I start with again? Palo Sand. Okay. That's kind of good. Um, I forgot, this. he doesn't have any fire types. He got to Levitate user. I think, is it worth setting up the Self Rock? Probably not. Probably not. It probably will be in the long run, but we're gonna try to go without it for now. Hopefully this Pikachu doesn't have Surf or anything like that because I would be a little bit upset. I'd be highly upset. I really like Pikachu as a Pokemon. If you know how to use a Pikachu, Pikachu is a Pokemon you should respect all the time. All the time, all the time. All right, Mewtwo comes out. We might have to set up the sun a little bit early. Burn, please. Yes, yes, Pokemon loves me again. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and set up the Stealth Rock here just in case he decides to play a switching game really often. Um, please, a side strike. This is defense. We should be able to take it. I'm pretty sure we can take it. My boys! We're making this Pewtwo look like a chump right now. And we're gonna keep doing so. Okay. Do I want. Did you see that? Okay, we found another opponent here, and they're bringing another intimidating team. This time we got the Volcarona. We got the Urshifu, we got the Jirachi, and the Rillaboom, and the Clefable, and the Slowbro. So his whole, his entire team is kind of scary right now. Who is he going to start with? I'm going to I'm going to predict. Um, I kind of want to predict the. Let's see, the Rillaboom, because if he starts Rillaboom, we can honestly uh, intimidate him, and then fake him out from there. Part of me should have started Cloyster in a way. But I'm still a little bit iffy about starting Cloyster as as much as I should. I love your lead card, Apothic uh, Apothican. Apothican is does that mean you're thick? No offense. Okay, I didn't mean to offend anybody. But Clefable comes out, and I brought in the uh, oh no, this isn't good. I brought in the hip on top. Intimidate's gonna go off. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is fake out and get the hashtag out of here. That's what we need to do to start things off. So. Go for a fake out. I still can't believe that guy with the Mewtwo rage quit on me. You're using a legendary Pokemon and you decide to leave. Like, how does that make sense? How does that make sense? My team is nowhere near OU. But yeah, <laughs> I, I still don't understand how that makes sense. But my should, should I predict the cosmic power? I kind of do. I kind of do. And I kind of want to go to the Venusaur to kind of threaten this thing out of here. Um, assuming that everything is okay, and assuming that, let's see. Well, it's gonna depend on what I decide to do after this turn. Calm mind, that's what I figured you were gonna go for. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put you to sleep. I'm gonna put you to sleep, and I think it's, I think we should be good with the turn one Dynamax. So, um, yeah, that's what we're gonna try to do. Put you to sleep, and we're gonna switch out of here. And we're gonna try to hit you with the physical attacker. Who? I don't know. All right, so something's being put to sleep. Not Clefable, but something. Jirachi, I will take that. I will absolutely take that. I'm glad I went for the sleep powder, and it misses. And it misses, nothing new. 
nothing new. I'm gonna go hit him on top to get the Intimidate out because this thing is gonna flinch me to death. And I'm just trying to prevent that right now, you know? I really wish I made this uh, him on top rather than Assault Vest a defensive oriented him on top. But it is what it is. Zen Headbutt actually hits and we're gonna take a lot of damage. Just as I thought. Okay. I mean, we're probably gonna go down. I'm gonna hit I'm gonna hit the earthquake. Zen headbutt. Then you hit again. We're going down. I should have gone into the Palo Sands. That's what I should have done. I don't know what I was thinking there. Alright, here comes the Palo Sand. I'm trying not to take an L today. I'm trying not to take an L today. Okay. So Jirachi is here. I think it's safe to say we're going to set up the Stealth Rock here. If you want to try to attack me, feel free to do so. We're going to set up the Stealth Rock because number one Vocal Run is there. He has a lot of Pokemon in the back that um, are going to be affected by the Stealth Rock in a way. Here comes the Slow. The Slow, bruh. Okay. Stealth Rock. It's a shame we don't have your boy. Um, it's a shame we don't have your boy. Your boy him on top anymore. I think I'm going to see and wait what this thing does to me. If he decides to Scald, I'm honestly just going to hit him with the Giga Drain. I outspeed him. I can't believe I outspeed this boy. That's kind of crazy to me. Ice Beam. Okay. I don't think he'll knock me out. That did a lot of damage. But it's not going to knock me out. Given that I outspeed, I should be able to take a couple more. We have the uh, delicious, nutritious leftovers also. And, um, yeah, I'm going to continue to Giga Drain. If you decide to switch next turn, I'm honestly going to go for the Shora. Okay. I think another Giga Drain will knock it out. I'm pretty sure it will. Ice Beam again. Please don't give me the hacks. I cannot afford the hacks anymore. It's like I saw it coming. It's like I saw it coming. <laughs> I'm not having fun with this anymore. Okay. Palosan's gonna have to go down, and that there's my defensive core. My defensive core is out of the battle. Um, just like that. Palosan, please. You're gonna go for what? Ice beam? I'm okay with that. I am a-okay with that. Okay. I don't really want to set up the sun as much as I want to. So I think what I'm gonna do here. Should I go Luxray? I think I'm gonna go Luxray. We go Luxray. We have guts. And um because if I wild charge, you're gonna pro or not wild, yeah, you're probably gonna bring the Jirachi or something else. And uh, I'm just trying to avoid all the, all of those shenanigans, okay? So hmm. The question is, what do I want to go for? Just in case he switches into a Shifu. This is a really bold prediction, I know. I'm going to go for the uh, play rough. Please bring a Shifu. Clefable. Okay. Okay. I guess that's fair. Lower the special attack, please. Nope. Nope. No. Okay. Um, oh, it lowers the attack, not special attack. Okay. I'm going to go with the wild charge now. I think... I just got to play aggressive at this point if I want to try to win. The Fable goes down. Beautiful. It's a crit! I don't think the crit mattered. No, sir. No, ma'am. I don't think it mattered. Okay, we're going to take some more damage from the Flame Orb, which uh, really doesn't matter. I'm really glad I got rid of the Clefable for sure. Now, if Jirachi wants to come in, I got no switch-ins. <laughs> I got no switchings. Volcarona comes out. Volcarona comes out. That's scary. Please do not hit me with the fiery dance. Please, please, please. We're going to try to risk the biscuit here. If he goes for a fiery dance or a quiver dance. Okay. I'm cool with that. Maybe I can leave. Maybe. Well, you have the heavy duty boots. That's one thing. Maybe you won't be able to live this wild charge as much as you think you will. Volcarona goes down. Luxray's putting in the work. I need to sneeze all of a sudden. I need to sneeze. Okay, the only threats now, the only big threat I would say that he has is the Yoshifu and the, um, what's the Pokemon called? Jirachi. Rage quit. Rage quit. You know you want to rage quit. 
Don't rage quit. Okay. Rillaboom does come out. I forgot about Rillaboom. I 100% forgot about the Rillaboom. Now he's going to hit me with the Grassy Glide and Luxray's going to go down. I think Luxray did all the work it needed to do, though. Because we don't outspeed any of the other Pokemon except for the Slowbro. So, really good job, Luxray. I am proud of you, Luxray. Win or lose this battle. It's a good one. Because we just brought it back. Even though I'm going to be at a disadvantage again. Because of the damage I'm about to take. Knock off. Okay. That's fine. It's a crit! <laughs> I don't think that one mattered either. It probably did. I don't know. I don't think so. Okay. He has her Shifu in the back. Um... I got the nine tails, the closer two. I'm gonna make a bold move, a, a bold prediction, and say that this thing is not banded. You're not banded. You can't be. No way you're banded. Um, shell smash. No way you're banded. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, Jirachi comes out, which is perfectly fine. Perfectly fine by me. I'm gonna go ahead. And hit the Shell Smash here. We got the White Herb for a reason. Given that this Jirachi is a physical attacker, my heart's pumping right now. My heart is pumping right now. Okay. Question is, can I knock this Jirachi out in one attack? Because if I can, that's going to be kind of huge. This thing is probably Scarfed. Ah, uh, should I Shell I want to Shell Smash again. Just in case it is Scarfed. Just in case it is Scarfed, because your base speed would be 150. I don't got my phone, so I can't really say what Cloister speed is. Woo, I'm scared. Because I don't want to Shell Smash, and then... I don't think it's worth, because... Um, Rillaboom has a Grassy Surge, or Grassy Glide, and it's gonna hurt. Okay, you're gonna force me to Dynamax now. That's fine. Force me to Dynamax. Okay. I think she's I think she's gonna try to force me to win with um Venusaur. Liquidation hit. Boom. The defense drop. That's that matters a little bit. Ma oh we're going down. We're going down. We live it! And this defense is down. Oh my goodness. We might win this. We might win this. An electric current runs across the field. We're gonna hit the liquidation here ah oh, does it knock out quite it doesn't quite knock it out okay that's perfectly fine it's a crit man that hacks in this battle and they do matter all of the hacks do matter i'm gonna go nine tails here because i'm i'm i feel like i'm forced to win with venusaur here nine tails comes out if this thing is uh jolly nature I still have speed given that I'm timid. Because your scarf is negated. I'm gonna hit the flamethrower. I'm gonna hit the flamethrower. Because if you go to slow bro, anyways, I still have speed. You outspeed me. We live somehow. Now the battlefield got weird. Okay. I see you, Jirachi. Flamethrower knocks you out. Boom goes the Jirachi. It's another crit. It's a crit. <laughs> How much crits are in this battle? This battle got me hyped. I'm so glad I have this Wi-Fi battle. I am so glad I have this Wi-Fi battle going here. Oh, man. Okay. This battle's intense. Jin comes out, who's probably your Shifu. And your Rapid Style. That is good news to me. I don't think I outspeed you, but if I do, I'm gonna I'm gonna be happy. Best believe. Best believe I'm gonna be happy. Aqua Jet. Oh, you messed up. You messed up. And I haven't Dynamaxed yet. Did I just win this? What else do you have in the back? The Slowbro and the. My boys, we're gonna win this. We're gonna win this. Oh, man. You should not have gone for the Aqua Jet. You messed that up. I would have outsped anyways, I think. I would have outsped. Don't rage quit, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. 
I, I know you'll knock me out. You'll knock me out with the grassy glide. I know you'll knock me out. The question is, how much turns do I have left of the, um, of the sun? How much turns of the sun do I got left? Oh, that's not what I wanted. Harsh sunlight, six out of eight. I got another turn, so I'll get knocked out here. That's fine. That is fine. Go for the glass, the grassy glide. I'll get knocked out. I haven't Dynamaxed yet. Now, my question is, do I Dynamax now or do I wait on it? Do I wait on it or do I do it now? Do I wait or do it now? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to do it now. And I'm going to go for a max lose because if you switch, I still get a plus one in special attack. I knew you were going to switch. I'm glad I didn't go for the, um, for the sleep. I'm glad I didn't try to put you to sleep. Because I'm still going to outspeed you. I should be able to take an attack from the Rillaboom. This, this comes down to this. It's going to come down to this right here. Beautiful, shiny, Gigantamax Venusaur. I love this Pokemon so much. I love it so much. Okay, I outspeed, of course. And you switched in, so you can't really attack me right now. Slowbro goes down. Slowbro goes down. And I'm going to take some damage from Life Orb, but I'm going to get that health back. Well, kind of. Kind of, not really. Okay, now you can you can get your leftovers all you want. I outspeed you. I outspeed you naturally. And I'm heavily invested. Oh, and the sun is still up. Look at that. Look at that. Now I think it's the last turn of sun. Max Ooze comes out. The only way this real boom is beating me is if there's some kind of shenanigan. Oh, my boy. You should have saved your Dynamax. I'm really glad I didn't panic and then Dynamax right away either. I'm so proud of that. And then last turn of Dynamax, I should win. I should win. My boys, please leave a like. Leave a like if you think this battle was hyped up. Because this is a really good battle. This is probably the best battle we've had in a while. And the, his team is straight up OU. Look at that. He got the Jirachi. He got the Rillaboom. Volcarona. Slowbro. Urshifu. And Clefable. All OU Pokemon. Or close to OU. Look at that. I outspeed him. I can't believe I won. I got my mojo back. I won. That was the closest battle I've had in a while. Such a beautiful battle. Such a beautiful league card. Thank you so much, Apo Apothician. Apothician? Apothician? Apothician. I don't know. I'm taking your league card. Thank you so much for that battle. That was so, so, so good. And I'm so thankful for it. But make sure that you guys, yes, I'm watching you. You, um, you're watching me, actually. And I thank you for watching me. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your kindness. Make sure you, yeah, you right there, you comment down below on your vote for the most valuable Pokemon of this Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. Me, I'm gonna say it's Venusaur. Some people might say it was Ninetales because it knocked out the Jirachi and took an attack. So vote, let me know in the comment section. If you wanna battle me, grab my Instagram link, send me a message or let me know in the comment section down below. Doesn't matter to me anymore. And leave a like, subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battles. It's your boy, Daddy Max, signing off. I'll see you guys next time.